Now, hi everybody. Well, today is the day before Mother's Day. And my mom is a very special lady to me, so is my mother-in-law. This is my mother-in-law, Molly. And this is, you know, my mom, this is many, many years ago, back in 1979. Here's me and my mom and my, uh, let me get, I grabbed the one picture. Me and my mom and dad, my grandma Elizabeth, grandma Bessie, and four generations of mommies. Mommy's, Mother's Day is a very difficult holiday for a lot of us because, you know, a lot of us don't have mom. This is my grandmother's china. It was, I, it came, she got it a hundred years ago. Can you believe that? So today we're making, uh, fingers, Luna. we're making Luna, Luna finger sandwiches. Most of the time, you use like eggs, a little bit of tuna fish, and you have a lot of mother-daughter teas this time of the year. Okay, just going to... Push this up a little bit. Misty's here too. Oh, but Misty's not a mommy. Neither is Mooney. No mommy pass right now. They all sort of can't have babies. Alright. We put some mayonnaise on this. Get a little salt. You have a lot of interesting things on Mother's Day that you don't have any other time of the year. And one thing I happen to notice Mom. is. I think they smell the tuna, and that's why they're oh. all gathering. All right, kitty cat, I know what you're smelling. I don't know how they know this tuna around, but they smell it. All right. Start with the egg salad. Put a little bit oh, of salt. you have to hand it to her. She's not going to eat it. Oh, mister, you're not a mommy. Yeah, you never know what they want. Okay. Now we're gonna put some eggs out. Um, these are like called little finger sandwiches. Oh, my doll is here too. Oh, no, you don't want tuna fish, do you? I think she does. Okay. Use a toothpick. It makes it very attractive, and you stick it right in here, and, and it holds the sandwich together. Now, <clears throat> the next thing is that we're gonna make some tuna salad with this. Just a little bit. You don't have to do a lot. It's just a very dainty, dainty holiday where we used to go to teas and everything like uh, Mom, they're fighting. Part. They're fighting. Oh, so you're gonna fight over the tuna fish? Oh well. Okay. Now, we're gonna be very careful. We don't wanna we wanna look at this as attractive as possible so that we can actually get this to come out really attractive. I know it's hard sometimes, folks. Alright, get a little bit of mayonnaise on that. We're gonna stick a toothpick in here. There we go. See? Okay, not easy to make these little devils, but yeah, this is what we get on Mother's Day. Here we go. We don't want to overdo this is a little bit overcrowded here. Okay. Yeah, sometimes it's just trying to make it a little too messy. Yeah, it's a little messy, folks. <laughs> but not to worry. Put a little toothpick in here. Now, the next thing I want to cut is a brownie, but I don't want to get any of the, the mess on here, so I'm going to wipe my hands. Often on Mother's Day, you can have some very delicate, you can have shortbread, you can have just a little brownie, you know. There we go. No. There we go. And here we have, for Mother's Day weekend, which is Mother's Day, is actually tomorrow. This is like what Grandma used to have for her tea parties. Very, very delicate and elegant. From Devil Age Home Country Kid, have a very happy Mother's Day. Let me get rid of this. Happy Mother's Day, everybody.